What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to the video today. Today I've got the brand new Moon Knight G Fuel Hydration Bottles. Now, I was not expecting these for a while. To be honest, I was not... Well, Amazon told me that they would not be delivered until like mid-May or early May. And all of a sudden, without even an out for delivery text, anything, they just say deliver. So I don't know what went on with Amazon, with G Fuel. I have no idea, but... That means we get to taste test these brand new Moon Knight hydration bottles. Now, I actually want to give a huge shout out to Ty over on Twitter because this guy actually sent me out a Moon Knight hydration bottle like a week ago, uh, but I wasn't able or allowed to review it until the actual like Amazon is public and that package comes in. I'm not sure exactly why, just something to do with G Fuel and Moon Knight and dates and stuff like that, but... I just want to say, Ty, I know that you sent me this one, so I want to say thank you. But without further ado, let's go ahead and crack these open, baby, shall we? So this is what the package looks like. You get this box that they come in from Amazon, and then this is what the package itself looks like. There's some information on there. None of my information, but just like where it ships from to Amazon and stuff like that. Uh, there is the bottom, there is the top. Of course, you got the little like cardboard holder uh, for the hydration bottles. You got G Fuel sugar-free uh, sparkling hydration. Let's go ahead and open this up. They put some pretty thick, thick boy plastic on these babies, let me tell you. I feel like we have not tried hydration bottles in a long time. This is the first hydration bottles that we have gotten in a while. I, I think the last ones that we got were maybe... Honestly, I don't remember what the last hydration bottles we got. Maybe MFAM Punch, or it could have been something else. This is what they look like in the case here. I'm gonna go ahead and put it down over here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here is what the Moon Knight hydration bottle looks like. As you can see, this is what she's looking like. Honestly, I really like this hydration bottle. I think it looks really awesome. Now, if you guys don't know what Moon Knight is, it is a new Marvel Studios series on Disney+. Plus. Um, I've heard it's pretty good. I haven't watched it yet, but I definitely encourage you guys to check it out if you have not watched it yet. So we've got G Fuel Sparkling Hydration. Now, this is caffeine free and it has vitamins and antioxidants and they usually do not have any artificial colors. That's something that is usually known for the hydration bottles. So it's basically the hydration tub, but uh, sparkling. And then we've got Moonberry here, flavored sparkling water. And then here is the label on the back. If you guys want to take a look at that, the video is in 4K. So you guys should be able to read that if you do pop the video up. And I also will leave a link down below to pick up these bottles if you guys want to on Amazon. Yeah, so it looks like they're still using vegetable juice to color these. So completely natural on the coloring. And I love the color so far. We'll have to put it into a glass to see it a little bit better, but it's kind of like a lavender purple-ish maybe. It's really cool. Here we go. Let's open up this hydration bottle, guys. Ooh. Now, if you guys do not know, it is supposed to be a blueberry acai flavor. And we all know what blueberry is, but acai is kind of... In my opinion, like this earthy, more tart berry, in my opinion. But let's go ahead and get a smell. Hmm. Smells like just blueberry, in my opinion. That is a very interesting smell, to be honest with you guys. Very interesting. It's just kind of blueberry. But I think I'm also getting some of that acai. It's kind of like an earthy, weird smell to it. I don't know, almost funky. Let's go ahead and put some of this into here and take a look at the color. Wow, look at that, bro. Look at that color, ladies and gentlemen. That is the color. It is very awesome. I might say that it does look a little more purple on camera, but in real life, it's almost like black 
It's almost like a light transparent black. Weird. Interesting. Very interesting. However, I love the color. I think it is spot on. This is what I thought black ooze in the cans would have looked like. I have no issue with them using coloring in the cans as long as it's natural coloring like this. I think it would be cool if the cans also had a color like this, but just use vegetable juice. Alright guys, let's go ahead and give this baby a taste, shall we? Here we go, the Moon Knight Hydration Bottle. Let's give it a go, Blueberry Acai. Hmm. Wow. Wow. That has a very, very strong blueberry taste to it. And it's almost more real blueberry. Yeah, that's real blueberry. That tastes a lot different than the hydration tub, in my opinion. This has like, I mean, they both barely have any acai, but I feel like this one has even more of a real blueberry taste to it in a stronger blueberry taste as well. Let's also go ahead and get a sip right out of the bottle. Okay, obviously way more carbonated right out of the bottle. I'm surprised how much carbonation these lose just by pouring it into a glass with a few ice cubes. I feel like they've lowered the carbonation on these. Um, I don't know why, but I kind of feel like they've lowered the carbonation. That is really good. Okay, I'm gonna say this right now. I'm really enjoying this. I was going to make a regular serving of G Fuel after this and go and keep working in the garage. Because if you guys don't know, also this week I'm going to be wrapping my car. So I do apologize if I'm a little uh, not as active this week as normal. I should still have videos and streams and report on news. But if I don't reply to as much Twitter and stuff like that, just know that I'm wrapping my car. So a lot of work to be done there. Of course, I am recording the whole process of wrapping my car, but I just want to let you guys know. Like I said, yeah, I was just going to go ahead and make another serving of like Divine Peach or something after this video. But I'm going to be honest, I think I'm just going to have this. This is pretty freaking good. And I'm going to put some of these in the fridge because these need to be refrigerated. Oh my God, they would be so much better if I refrigerate these. I really, really like these guys. I really like them. I mean, just think of like a blueberry soda, maybe. I would say it's like a blueberry soda. Yeah, think of like a blueberry soda. And it's, it's really good, man. It really is good. Wow. Let me just say, if you're thinking, is this blueberry like Shiny Splash? I would say no. I don't think this blueberry is like Shiny Splash at all. Shiny Splash is more of a artificial candy blueberry. This is much closer to a real blueberry in my opinion. I'm really curious to know what you guys think because I do think it has a little bit of a funky taste to it. That could be the acai. That could be the very real natural blueberry taste coming through. But... I kind of like that. I don't know. I want you guys to let me know what you think of these if you get them. Let me know if you're thinking about getting them. But overall, I would say it's about a 90% real-ish blueberry and about a 10% acai. And I would give it about an 8.9 out of 10. I'd still recommend Blue Chug Rug and MFAM Punch Hydrations more. But overall, I really, really like this and I would highly recommend it. And I love the color on it as well. Thank you everybody for watching the video. I really do appreciate it. If you guys want to check out my review of the hydration tub, that is up on the channel as well. But thank you guys for being here and peace out, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure to drop a like and don't forget to use code SHOCK. It should be turning 30% this Thursday, I believe. So thank you guys to any of you that do use that.